What's up guys, back into the video. Today I'm going to go over on how to enable Workspace Windows Ink Workspace. Now Windows Ink Workspace is actually kind of cool because you can make screenshots, you can draw stuff, you know, in case you have a touch screen and whatnot. You can do pretty cool things with Windows Workspace. So we're going to learn on how to enable and disable them. Now these two, um, these two files right here are one that enables it and then or shows it down in the taskbar and also hides it at the same time. So you get two options on one or not if you want to show them or hide them. All you have to do if you want to show it, click, uh, double click on the show one. And then there you go, it actually shows up now. It's right here. And if you want to hide it, double click this one and then it hides it so it no longer shows up. But this is just for a backup in case. So you don't need to download these. They'll be in an archive file called uh, Workspace in a dot zip. So you can go ahead and download these um, anywhere on the internet. So um, there'll be links in the description bar if you want to download these just in case. Now since um, since we don't really need them, then how do we do it? So the first thing what we can do is that we can right click here and then it says show Windows Ink Workspace. You can also show touch keyboard button also so you can add both of them within one. But I have no reason to be using this because there's just really no point for me to be using it. But for this, obviously I'm going to be using this. So that is how you enable Windows Ink Workspace. I'll catch you guys in the next video. Hit the like and the subscribe button. Check out the links in the description. One of them leads to my Discord server. The other one leads to my uh, referral link to HRK Games, which you can get extra discounts. And also HRK Games are hot random keys games that allow you to get free games every day. I'll catch you guys in the next one.